Hi, welcome to the hothotsoftware.com copy files to multiple folder locations in batch or move multiple files in bulk software. Basically what the software allows you to do is copy a bunch of different files from different fire file locations on your computer into different file folders. Now some of the major benefits are as follows. If you are any kind of system admin and you need to say back up to different computers or back up to different locations and so forth, uh, then this software can be very useful. If you are a programmer and doing some kind of testing like load testing or you want uh, to randomly test and see what kind of results you get uh, with your software, then this can also be uh, very useful. Um, and there is several other different uses. If you just have a bunch of different files, say uh, you have a number of applications open at once, uh, maybe you have an Excel spreadsheet and uh, then you also have some image files and you're just editing a whole bunch of different stuff, then this would also be useful because then you can back it up at regular intervals as well. Uh, anyways, obviously to add the different files, you click on Add Files and it would pop up a little box where you could add them. You could clear the list. You can choose by file type. So for example, if you just wanted text files, image files, Excel files, whatever, uh, you would just uh, specify the type. You can also uh, do it right here, like instead of star dot star, star dot text, and so forth. And you can finally do it recursively. Um, then this would be a list of folders that you want to copy it to. By default, I've just put it here, but you could have a bunch of different folders and so forth, and it would copy the files into each and every one of those folders. And finally, then once you're done, um, uh, you would either choose the interval that you want to back up at so it has these defaults such as five ten minutes and so forth or you could have a custom backup which is in seconds once you finally got everything set up let's say you wanted it every five seconds you click this button and then it would automatically start backing it up and you see the little countdown timer rate and that's the software